Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Paula Akana. And I'm Laura Yamada. KITV4 News has learned incoming city prosecutor Keith Kanashiro is firing 10% of the lawyers in the city prosecutor's office, including some of the most experienced prosecutors there. Eleven attorneys found out today they would be out of a job as of Monday, the day Kanashiro is sworn in as prosecutor. The exclusive story now from KITV 4 is Kyoki Kerr. Kyoki. Well, Lara, all of the city's 105 deputy prosecutors serve at the pleasure of the city prosecutor, so he can hire and fire whoever he wants for whatever reason. But are politics to blame for these firings? Deputy Prosecutor Michelle Pu'u was in the middle of jury selection in a robbery trial today when she got word that Keith Kaneshiro will terminate her Monday, forcing a three-week delay in the trial. It was bizarre that, that this would happen, you know, right as the trial was starting. We, my defendant was there and we were going to go forward with the trial. A seven-year veteran, Poo has about 40 felony trials pending, and even those who've opposed her in the courtroom say she's top-notch. I've worked with Michelle for years, and uh, she's a good prosecutor. People on drugs killed. Kanashiro is also firing Kevin Takata, a deputy prosecutor for 23 years who's head of the Felony Trials Division. He has more murder convictions than any other lawyer in the office and is prosecuting the case of Adam Mao, who's charged with the murder of three people at the Tatalus lookout. Mao's defense attorney says, I'm disappointed that they're being let go because they represented the highest ideals in prosecutorial activity. Brooke Hart wonders how well cases will be handled with the abrupt firings of 11 deputy city prosecutors who are in the middle of trials and investigations. It's probably uh, disruptive in any professional environment to in effect, uh, change horses midstream. Kaneshiro's spokeswoman says he looked carefully at each attorney in the office before deciding which ones to retain. But sources in the prosecutor's office say Kaneshiro met with none of those he fired, and they ask how he could evaluate someone fully without ever having even met some of them. Defense attorney Miles Briner says he was one of 13 deputies fired by Kaneshiro back when he was first elected prosecutor in 1988. He terminated anyone... Uh, that apparently had any sympathy for his opponent. Reiner claims many of the prosecutors fired this time were people who supported Don Picaro, one of Kaneshiro's opponents in the special election. Yes, I think it's politically motivated. Now, we should point out that Don Picaro, who is a deputy prosecutor, is not on the list of 11 people that Kaneshiro is terminating. So for now, Kaneshiro is keeping his old political opponent on the staff. Kaneshiro's spokeswoman says he has six experienced deputy prosecutors ready to start work on Monday, uh, partially replacing those people who are being uh, let go, including three veterans who served in the office before. She says Kaneshiro will have a fully competent team in place and ready to go. Laura, back to you. All right, thanks, Kiyoki.